Tanzania and from Ethiopia is already rehearsing. So what you see here is uh, yeah, not our stage set, we'll build up a little bit later, but you will see already some artists while they are training, preparing, warm up, so you just can go around and have a look what's going on here. In that case, it's Jean Marc, and he's moving like, yeah, like you, uh, like there is an engine inside, like that. Maybe you can, you can show it. Are you, are you good? Good noise or bad noise? Somebody inside. How he moved, that's a secret. Oh. Yes, a mini skateboard. I think so. <laughs> I think so. Thank you. Thank you. Good fellow. You are sweet. So I'm coming from the Chinese circus because I worked with Chinese circus since 10 years. Wow. But after 10 years, you can. So you can do that quick movement as well. Yeah. Oh, cool. Wow. And so, so that one. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm coming from the Chinese circus. So uh, I get a little bit bored about the circus because and also the competition is very high in Europe. So I was thinking about another idea. So I thought, okay, let's go to Africa. Nobody has presented an African circus so so far. But then I, I, I had to realize that there are no artists in Africa. Very, very, only a few, 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 because there is no tradition about circus. So I went to embassies in Berlin to ask for help, and everybody was helpful, but nothing happens. And that, by mistake, my now my friend and the director of the circus, Winston Ruddle, from Zimbabwe, came to my office, and he had the same idea. And he, as an artist, I had the knowledge about producing and uh, touring and booking, so we came together. But it needs about two years because uh, the profession, professionality of the artist was really weak in the beginning. So I sent him away two years. And after two years I said, okay Winston, let's do it. But let's add some nice dancers, a live band, etc. etc. So Mother Africa was born. When you look for um, cast of your show, yeah. like cer certain numbers, what yeah. exactly do you look for? Do you look for particular traits or attitude? Yeah, this is a job of my friend and director Winston Ruddle. Mm. And he is scouting. This is the one we are doing, just uh, traveling around Africa, looking for talents, and also you are you finding you find some people on the street doing crazy things, typical African things. So we put this in, and on the other side we get some people from small African circus schools. You find them only in, in yeah, but, but very very tiny ones, small ones. We only have them in Ethiopia, in uh, South um, South Africa, and in Sudan. And in Burkina Faso. We also built up a circus school in Tanzania, 2005. And in the meanwhile, I can say our artists became more or less the same skillful as the Chinese are, because the Chinese are world class. So, but we now we can compete with them. And for example, we have Lazaro Kitu from Kenya, and he's the most flexible man in the world. He has appeared already on many TV shows in China, and the Chinese people went crazy about this guy. So he must be good. Enchanting rhythm, captivating dance, breathtaking performance. For the first time in Singapore, Africa's most amazing spectacle. This is Cirque Mother Africa. April 12 to 15 at the Esplanade Theatre. Tickets through cystic.com.sg.